What up guys, it's your boy Adam Rise here. I got some great news and some cool shit to share with you guys. Alright, so basically I am now a director for Akron, as you can see in the corner, uh, at the right hand corner at the top, that I am now a director and they have their watermark and everything. So and pretty much all my commentaries from now on, the director thing is going to be there. And I basically was trying to find a game for like fucking... 30 minutes man I made a video in the first five minutes uh, you can go check it out about how I hate these stupid ass servers on Starhawk but I love the freaking game <laughs> sorry if I blow into my mic it's cuz I'm breathing right now like it's like 3 in the morning I'm tired as hell <laughs> and so basically this whole game rocks except for the servers that's the only thing I really don't like about it and kinda the the primary gun you start off with kinda sucks cuz it takes like two hours to kill somebody not literally two hours, but it takes about uh, it takes about 100 bullets, no lie. Um, but other than that, all the other guns that are in the game so far are pretty sick. The rocket launcher is like a javelin. It's awesome. It takes everything out. It locks on the airplanes, locks on the freaking bunch of things like people with jetpacks. That's a badass thing to have in a game too, a jetpack. Like, come on, that's fucking sick, man. I feel like... I'm about, uh, like, I'll go in, jump into the enemy base, and basically just tear shit up, and then, bam, backpack out of there. <laughs> and, uh, the whole game is, like, freaking awesome. Like, it's got the battlefield feel. Like, feel. I don't know if I said the right feel. But, um, like, when you kill somebody, they could see you after you die for a while. <laughs> and you just go up and teabag them, and it's so funny, dude. They'll send you a message later on, and be like, oh, you're such a dick. And I'll be like, yeah, yeah, I am. Go check out my YouTube channel. <laughs> and here's some, like, video gameplay of the the actual robot itself turning into, like, a freaking monstrous jetpack. Not jetpack, but a jet plane. And I like that in the game, in the air, you can go pick up, like, weapons in, in the midair. We'll go through rocks and stuff to find weapons, and you just use them. I kind of fail at trying to get it out. Uh, you'll see here that... Uh, I'm trying to switch to it, but I fucking I'm too concentrated on flying, and I basically just say fuck it and I turn around. <laughs> so right here I land in the enemy base. I just start like fucking looking for shit around here. I think at the, towards the end I fail and I I land in the enemy base and I grab the flag and I completely forgot I had it. So I just start shooting and blowing things up, <laughs> and one of the guys kills me. So I'm like ah oh, damn I had the flag and I didn't realize till like after I died. <laughs> And I like how when you uh, get shot at the screen, it's all cool looking like. It's pretty awesome. And the shotguns in this game are monstrous up close. They're one shot kill usually, but like from a distance, kind of a little bit, not not up close, but a little bit farther than up close. It, oh my god, it completely sucks. Like, if you were about to die and you pull out the shotgun, and he's just a little bit out your reach, you're screwed. You're done. There's basically no way. And there's kind of like, it's not a, a if I shoot you first uh, kind of deal. They could turn around, and they could just quick turn on you and just fucking destroy you. But um, that's what I like about the game is real competitive, and I like how you could build. Uh, I basically you can build a wall, uh, a few turrets, uh, land like to make it where you can land somewhere because you can only land in your base. But if you put up like this big ass machine, the, it'll allow you to like uh, land in that area that you put up the machine. But it's cool how you can like land and crush somebody. You can crush somebody with the machine, and it's so fucking sick. Like the game is, I recommend you really try it. And I like the cars too. They're like badass. I just honk at everybody when I'm <laughs> when I'm about to go steal their flag. I just go through there, just honk a few times, run a few people over. It's it's pretty badass, man. <laughs> And if I say man, it's because, like, I'm in my pothead kind of talking voice. If I mess up, like, with gibberish sometimes, it's because commentaries are pretty hard. I'm doing one tries only. Like, I don't, I don't go doing 100 tries, like, usually. Like, I gave that up. I'm just going to do first try commentaries from now on. And even if I fuck up, I'm going to upload it, you know? Like, fuck it. Um, maybe if I fuck up really bad, I'll, I'll do a second try. But other than that, I won't. <laughs> And I like how this, it's pretty cool when you pick up the flag in, in CTF because when you capture the flag and it's on your back, it like glows 
while you're running. So like if you're in a dark area, you kind of get scared. Like is there somebody with the headlights on behind me? Like uh, cause in the cars you can turn on the headlights. <laughs> and you chase people that have grabbed your flag. And you just don't want to look back because you want to keep running. And that's what I like too. Like you can sprint constantly. You don't run out of like breath. Like uh, if you play Call of Duty, when you run and you don't have like marathon. 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 You basically stop running as quick as you can. So that's that's what I like about this game too. That you can run constantly. And I wish I got some gameplay of the of the jetpack in this game, but I didn't unfortunately. I didn't get to show you guys everything. Well everything because um basically I was I was super tired. It was like two in the morning when I got this gameplay. It was my first try, my only game because the servers are shit and they kick you out after like one game. <laughs> Supposedly they're gonna get them fixed pretty soon, but I don't see why they would if it's a beta They're kind of acting like if it's the full game release already, so it's kind of dumb if they do I would just wait so I Definitely will buy this game though, and if you got like if you hate the game, you know Let me know why and like if you love the game, you know tell me why too, you know um, I'm going on uh, how many minutes here five minutes of talking. I mean this shit's hard <laughs> And basically, the whole game is just a well-rounded game because you don't lag in game when you do. Well, there's a lag, but it's not the kind of lag you think. It's kind of like, um, how do we put it? Like, it'll say net stall on top of your screen, but you won't really lag. It'll let you know you're about to lag. That's what I like too. It's got detective like, it's got like a warning system to when you're gonna lag, so you kind of know to go hide in a corner while while the lag's going on so it, when it passes through the lag you can just get on with the game so that's that's what I like a lot about this game too but usually you don't lag at all or uh, you never get kicked from a game the, once it's started but like before and after the games you do get kicked I, I swear I hate that so much I'll be playing with some complete like sucky ass people and I feel like a god playing them and then all of a sudden, bam, failed to connect. It's just like, ah, oh, man, I was wrecking these kids up. I was like, free points. And that's what I like about this game, too. Ranking up is not easy at all. Like, it takes 100 games just to get up to, like, freaking level 6. I'm, like, level 6 or 7. I'm not sure. But I know that. <laughs> In this gameplay, I'm not a beast-ass player. Like, I'm not going all try hard and stuff. I was just trying to get a, a decent gameplay. <laughs> as you would say a decent gameplay but I'm gonna be uploading montages of this game uh, Call of Duty montages I'm gonna be uploading a lot of stuff I'm gonna have a, a lot of series going a series sorry about my voice um, super tired I'm gonna get some Minecraft series let's plays going uh, I got um, I got some RuneScape planned I got some Skyrim I play lots of games so there will definitely be a lot of gameplay up uploaded by me but <laughs> um I kinda on the the yes or no on StarCraft. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of it. It's a pretty sick tactical game but it's kinda boring when you actually watch somebody play unless they're funny. <laughs> but other than that I probably won't maybe once or twice but most likely not. Um I do have a uh an Xbox I only play Gears of War, Halo, and Modern Warfare 3, and that's pretty much it. And it's, it's not really that often. You can go ahead and add me. It's uh, Admirize on Xbox also, but I, I probably won't be playing on there too much. But if you really want to add me and you want to play with me, um, I'm pretty fun to play with. I, I like to make a lot of people laugh, you know. I try and make the whole game funny. But it, when I'm starting to rage... People tend to get mad at me because I start cussing and yelling and don't control it like every other rager. <laughs> well, I don't really throw my controller, but I kind of like just squeeze it. You know how when you get that anger that someone just killed you and you know they're a noob? You just squeeze your controller. Like that try hard, trying too hard when you're trying to get a uh, sniper montage. That's how I feel sometimes. <laughs> but you know, everyone has those moments, so. But back to Starhawk. The game is incredible. Like. You can you have so much fun it, and the games are not like like Call of Duty ten minute games well, not ten minute games but like they're around the same length 
but they feel longer because you're paying more attention. You're not out there constantly rushing. You can rush in this game, and it, it's it's real. Pro, it's sorry for that. That poor, like kind of. Uh, it's, it's real fun to rush in this game, but you're better off playing the tactical, like thinking what you're gonna do first before you go do it. Instead of like just going out there and rushing and shooting whatever you see. This is like you gotta build your base, get a stronghold, um, you gotta make your flag, make sure it's protected. And there's some gameplay of an actual I, I think you just seen a jetpack. But um Yeah, you gotta be strategic right here in this game, and that's what I like about it. So, alright, that's pretty much coming to the end of this gameplay. Um basically you guys should go check out the demo if you're on PlayStation 3. Uh, Xbox, I'm sorry, you guys don't...